dispersion and the principles of powder rheology. Rooted in history, dispersion, and powder rheology still are pivotal in shaping numerous industries, exerting their influence across diverse processes, from pharmaceuticals to paints and food production. To grasp the depth of their impact, it is interesting to explore the history and background surrounding dispersion and powder rheology. The gradual unfolding of the evolution of dispersion and powder rheology allows us to unravel the intricacies of these fundamental aspects and, in turn, gain insight into their symbiotic relationship, which continues to play a crucial role in shaping various industrial processes. History While being integral components in various industrial processes across the globe, both dispersion and powder rheology continued to evolve alongside advancements in materials science, chemistry, and engineering. The history of dispersion dates back to ancient times when pigments were first used in cave paintings. However, the systematic understanding and manipulation of dispersion took a more structured form during the Renaissance period. Artists and craftsmen explored various techniques to disperse pigments in mediums like oils and tempera, leading to the development of more vibrant and stable colors in paintings. In the scientific arena, the concept of dispersion gained prominence in the late 19th and early 20th centuries. Pioneering scientists, such as John William Strutt and Robert Smolohovsky, made significant contributions to understanding the scattering of light and colloidal dispersions among other things. The advent of advanced microscopy and spectroscopy techniques in the 20th century further deepened our comprehension of dispersion phenomena. In the mid-20th century, with the rise of materials science and the development of more sophisticated analytical tools, powder rheology became a distinct field of study. Researchers like Andrew Yenike made substantial contributions to the understanding of powder flow, introducing fundamental concepts like the flow function and cohesive strength. Powder rheology has its roots in the Industrial Revolution, particularly in the powder metallurgy and pharmaceutical industries. The need for efficient powder handling and processing led to the exploration of the flow and deformation behavior of powders. Early experiments focused on understanding how powder properties influenced processes like compaction and sintering. Dispersion Dispersion, the uniform distribution of particles, is a cornerstone in various industrial applications. Employing techniques like ultrasonication, milling, and high-pressure homogenization ensures homogeneity. In pharmaceuticals, effective dispersion guarantees consistent drug formulations, while in paints, it contributes to uniform color and texture. The food industry also reaps benefits, particularly in processes like flavor encapsulation. Powder Rheology Within the domain of powder rheology, the intricacies of molecular dynamics unfold, wherein the distribution of particle sizes emerges as a decisive factor governing both flowability and cohesion. The organization of diverse forces, encompassing attractions and repulsions, intricately regulates the conduct of particles within the confines of a powder system. Here the surface area and geometric disposition of particles play an indispensable role in shaping the flow characteristics of the powder. Specific surface interactions, exemplified by van der Waals forces and electrostatic repulsions, intricately modulate interparticle forces, exerting influence not only on flowability but also on the overall cohesion exhibited by the powder. The seemingly inconspicuous parameter of moisture content exerts a substantial impact on powder characteristics. At the molecular level, moisture engages with powder particles, inducing alterations in surface properties and instigating capillary forces. This interaction between moisture and powder assumes critical significance, emerging as a pivotal consideration in comprehending and manipulating the behavior of powders during processing. The inception of the powder flow function concept represents a paradigmatic advancement in precision, offering a mathematical framework to quantify and prognosticate powder behavior across diverse conditions. This concept seamlessly integrates parameters such as consolidation stress and powder compressibility, affording a more holistic comprehension of the intricate rheological panorama. Cohesive and adhesive forces necessitate a thorough examination of molecular interplays between particles. Van der Waals forces, hydrogen bonding, and electrostatic attractions collectively contribute to cohesion, influencing the powder's capacity to uphold structural integrity. The elucidation of these forces yields nuanced insights into the impact of cohesive and adhesive interactions on powder flow, presenting a pathway for tailoring rheological characteristics with meticulous precision. The Symbiosis The symbiotic relationship between particle dispersion and powder rheology is crucial for homogeneity in powder systems, profoundly affecting rheological properties. Technically, particle dispersion is important for uniform powder matrices, a critical factor in tailoring rheological characteristics. This interdependence extends beyond homogeneity, impacting flow behaviors, compressibility, and other rheological aspects. In a chemical context, effective dispersion's molecular arrangement significantly influences particle interactions, modulating the powder's rheological profile. 
Examining dispersion mechanisms involves scrutinizing surface energies, intermolecular forces, and particle electrostatic nature. This molecular level understanding is crucial for optimizing manufacturing processes and ensuring precise particle arrangement manipulation for desired rheological outcomes. In industrial applications, the symbiotic relationship of dispersion and rheology is even more pronounced. Achieving uniform dispersion, driven by tailored parameters, facilitates the creation of powders with consistent rheological behavior. This consistency is vital in processes from compaction to sintering, where dispersed particles directly influence end product efficiency and quality. Molecular Dynamics At the particle level, chemical reactions during dispersion and powder processing influence the final product's composition and properties. These reactions involve intricate transformations, including atom rearrangement and novel chemical bond formation. In dispersion, especially in liquids, reactions may occur between dispersed material and the dispersing medium, leading to changes in surface properties. Similarly, in powder processing stages like mixing or heat treatment, chemical reactions are pivotal. In powder metallurgy, blending metal powders can initiate solid-state reactions, forming alloys. Heat during processes like sintering induces transformations, contributing to powder consolidation. During liquid dispersion, dissolution reactions may occur, breaking ionic bonds within salt crystals. In powder processing, solid-state reactions occur during metal powder blending, forming compounds like cementite (FeC) in sintering. Heat-induced sintering reactions contribute to densification, especially in ceramic powder processing, where oxide powders react to form new compounds. Understanding these processes reduces activation energy barriers, optimizing conditions. Knowledge of reaction kinetics allows precise control over temperature and pressure, enhancing overall reactivity. In applications with well-dispersed powders as catalysts, particle-level reactions, like hydrogenation or oxidation, significantly influence system reactivity. These principles apply in various industrial settings, such as pharmaceutical production, where reactions during powder processing contribute to drug composition. In catalyst manufacturing, surface reactions of dispersed particles, especially in heterogeneous catalysis, influence catalytic activity. Applications and Benefits In the pharmaceutical industry, dispersion and powder rheology play a crucial role in drug formulation. Oral solid dosage OSD, products, such as tablets and capsules, consist of active ingredients dispersed among excipients, which are powders with various roles, including stabilizing and bulking up the tablet, improving powder flowability during manufacture, and enhancing drug absorption or solubility. Understanding the powder flow characteristics and behaviors of powders during manufacture is essential for efficient handling and quality control. In the paint and coatings industry, dispersion and rheology are essential for achieving consistent color and texture. Rheology modifiers are added to the mill base during the production process to obtain optimal flow behavior, stability, and application properties. These additives influence production properties, enhance anti-settling properties during storage, and improve sag resistance and the film formation process. The food industry benefits from dispersion techniques such as flavor encapsulation, which ensures uniformity and stability of flavor substances. Encapsulation in the form of micro and nanotechnology addresses challenges related to flavor substances' susceptibility to evaporation and poor stability in the presence of air, light, moisture, and heat. Encapsulation techniques, including spray drying, spray chilling, emulsification, and cultivation, are used to develop micro or nanoparticles of flavor substances, enhancing their stability and functionality in food products. Exploring further dimensions. The sector of powder technology provides a vast canvas for research and development, encompassing advancements in dispersion techniques, innovations in powder rheology, and potential applications across diverse industries. Advances in dispersion techniques leverage significant shearing forces, representing a noteworthy avenue for further exploration. Emerging technologies in powder rheology, exemplified by the powder rheology accessory, extend the capabilities of rheometers to embrace powders. This expansion allows for a comprehensive characterization of powder behaviors throughout storage, dispensing, processing, and eventual end use. Looking forward, the potential applications of powder technology extend into transformative sectors, with 3D printing emerging as a rapidly evolving Industry 4.0 technology. Powder Bed Fusion PBF, a cutting-edge additive manufacturing technique, swiftly integrates across industries, with high-performance 3D-printed metal parts finding innovative applications in architecture, aerospace, and medicine. While in powder metallurgy, manufacturers actively seek to elevate powder density, propelling the evolution of this dynamic field.